Philip Ross. Yes, I thought you would like that better than Luke Philbert Ross. And you have not seen the best part. Luke Chick Magnet Ross. <laughs> you are hereby officially designated a Yankees bat boy. I hope you do not get dizzy hanging upside down in the dugout. Sports humor nailed it. <laughs> Besides you. Looks like somebody's ordering husband number seven. Carlisle, whip cream and keep it coming. Yes, just what you need. More sugar. <laughs> All right, it's got to be here somewhere. Thank you. Okay, that was new. <laughs> Trying to escape, were we? Wait a minute. This isn't the code room. <laughs> Jesse, this is ridiculous. I'm just gonna be a man and tell my mommy to pay for our dinner. Brooks, wait. I'm not just worried about paying for this meal. It's all the meals after this and for the rest of your life. Maybe it is just better if you break up with me. Just no. What, are you really willing to give up your entire lifestyle, the money, everything, for the girl you just met? Although I do look banging in this dress. <laughs> you mean... The girl who was willing to fall into a toilet for me? Who loves animals as much as I do? Who makes me melt when I look into her eyes? Maybe this will answer your question. Mother, we need to talk. Oh, Brooks, if that hell you've come groveling back. Now let's get out of here before somebody sees me with new money here. <laughs> That's it. I've had it. I don't need your money. And I am sick of you controlling me. I don't control you. Blow. No. no. I've had a better time with Jesse these past few weeks than I've ever had in my life. You should really try go party. So you can keep it all, Mother, because I would rather be poor and happy with Jesse than rich without her. That is the most wonderful thing a guy has ever said about me. Seriously, number two is... It's so refreshing to date a girl who really knows her way around a carburetor. <laughs> Jesse, for the last time, we want you to be with Tony. Brooks, for the last time, I want you to be with anybody but Stressy. <laughs> hey, you know what? It's not about what makes you happy. It's about what makes us happy. That's right. And we will stay in this restaurant forever if we have to. No! No, you won't. <laughs> you people have caused enough commotion. And you're covered in toilet water. <laughs> I will pay your bill. Thank you. I'll pay you back. Your absence will be payment enough. <laughs> Plus, I'll take that watch. <laughs> Ow! That's your tip. Here's a tip for you. Call your lawyer. I'm suing you for harassment. <laughs> I love it when they play hard to get. <laughs> so... You may have won this battle. Point! Lovebirds! But the war is not over. Come, virgins. Are you sure there's enough room on your broom? Well, I don't know how we're going to get home. I have a feeling Mother's canceled my limo. <laughs> well, we can do what most New Yorkers do and take the stuff back. I've always wanted to do that. <laughs> Are there really giant alligators down there? Yeah, but they're not as scary as the guy who plays his nose hair. Oh, my hand. Gladly.